Hello and welcome to this video where I'm going to be going over Jasper.ai for social media. So they come with quite a few templates in their social media section, but I'm going to pick just a few that I happen to really like that could get you a lot of engagement or some new ideas for your next post. If you'd like to follow along, I will put my link down below in the description that allows you to not only get a free trial, but many bonus words to test this out for your social media usage. Let's begin. If you do want to follow along with me, I'm under templates and of course social media. These are going to be the social media related ones. Obviously, there's going to be some that you can kind of use for almost anything, but good ones that I'm going to do here are going to be the engaging questions. I'm going to go with the uh, photo post captions. We have the TikTok captions and, of course, Tweet Machine. Quora Answers is good. I could do another video about that, although I think I've done one. I've done so many. I believe I've done it, but let's get started with engaging questions. In case you're new to Jasper, here's how it works. Let's enter in the information on the left side, which I've already done. Our topic is going to be our AI copywriting software tools going to be the way of the future so this could be an engaging question very uh what's what's the word uh it goes back and forth i can't think of the proper word not polarizing but uh it's a mix and match of yes and no usually audience is going to be bloggers and internet marketers tone of voice is casual you could do excited you could do witty you could do dramatic you could do really whatever you want for this i'm just going to do two and let's generate and see what we get so keep in mind sometimes when you do these, like if you do two, that means you get two batches of a lot of questions. So in case you don't want to use up like a ton of words at once, you can always start small and do one or two, see how many you get. And then you can do either less, more, or just keep it how it is. So here we are. Do you think AI copywriting software tools are going to be the way of the future? What benefits do you think AI copywriting software tools have? How do you think AI copywriting software tools compare to human copywriters? Do you think they'll eventually replace human copywriters? And would you consider using an AI copywriting software? Software tool for your business. So these are all very good. Obviously related. One was similar, pretty much kind of the same thing. Was it worded differently? No, it was the same. But aside from that, it gives us a lot of other variations and different questions that we could ask, like instead of it being the way of the future, it talks about will it replace human copywriters? Would you ever use one? Do you think they'll be the norm? What are your thoughts? Uh, how do you think it will compare to human generated copy? Will it replace human writers and so on and so forth? Overall, pretty good. What we're getting here is not only the question being asked, but asked in a different way and different forms, which is usually what you're looking for. It's kind of like copywriting when you write a headline. There's many ways to write it. And usually there's going to be one, maybe two ways that really click with your audience. So that will give you some new ideas. Next, we have photo post captions in case you know you just did something cool. You can't think of something witty off the top of your head. Uh, you can just go with this. I just put, I just made it to Queenstown, New Zealand. I didn't just make it there, but I've been there before. So I like talking about it. It was so beautiful there. Uh, I live in Florida, so I'm pretty far away. And it's it was quite different from what I get to experience here with pretty much sun and hurricanes all the time. Well, hurricanes sometimes, but uh, this is everything you see right here. Let's generate. Yeah, so once again, this is one that's different. So before we did two and we get batches, but you notice how like it's only two. Let's just do a bunch more then and then we'll generate. Okay, here we go. OMG, finally made it to Queenstown, New Zealand. This place is unreal. I'm officially a New Zealander, loving every minute of it here in Queenstown. I feel like I'm in a movie. I, I did have that feeling. The views are just so beautiful. Uh, my new favorite place on earth. I made it to Queenstown. Boy, is it beautiful here. I can't wait to explore more of this amazing country. We made it finally here and it feels so real. I did it. I made it to the most beautiful place on earth. That might be one of the most beautiful places. If you're from New Zealand, you know, do you agree? Have you been there before? I've <laughs> been dreaming about this place for years and I finally made it. I made it to the land of the Middle Earth. Nowhere else in the world compares. All right, cool. So those will give you ideas. Obviously, if you want to add more in it, like something you specifically did, like you're going, um, was that go-karting at the top of the mountain or you're going on like the ski lift thing obviously the more input you put there the more specific it's going to be i just made it pretty broad so you could see some examples next we have tiktok captions so but jasper.ai just wrote a 1000 word article for me in under 10 minutes i'm excited let's go with two and see what we get and once again this these are a little bit longer so you know we can just do a few here and then i'm going to generate more so i can read some for you as well who needs writers when you can use Jasper? It wrote a thousand article in 10 minutes. I'm so impressed and absolutely loving this new tech. I just witnessed something amazing. It wrote a 1000 word article in under 10 minutes. It's easy. All I had to do was provide the topic and it wrote up all the facts and details I needed. Uh, just amazed. Uh, under 10 minutes. 
crazy, amazing technology that's going to revolutionize the way we do research. Couldn't be happier with the results. Found the answer to our article writing woes. Just wrote me a 1000 word article in under 10 minutes. It's like having my own personal article writing robot at my fingertips. I'm so excited. And the last two, which we did before, I'm just going to keep that hovered over there. If you want to pause the video, feel free to, or just come back to it. I don't want to read all of them all through. They look pretty great. Just kind of skimming them over. And last but not least, we have the tweet machine. Okay. What is your tweet about? I put prediction movie theaters are going to be just about gone within the next decade, which is, it could be a possibility. I'm not saying I 100% agree with that. I just came up with off the top of my head, but you can see the way streaming's going. Like it, it's kind of like blockbuster. You know, I see movie theaters are trying to do like the recurring billing now where you pay like 20 bucks and you can see as many movies as you want, something like that. But it's just so hard to catch up to like Netflix and Amazon and it, it could be a blockbuster all over again. Anyway, let's generate and see what we get. Okay, so there we go. So this is one a little bit different. When you do one input, you get 10 of them. So imagine if you did 10 here, you'd probably get around 100. So uh, you'd better see a movie in the theater soon because they'll be extinct by the end of the decade. Save your money for Netflix and show the days of movie theaters are numbered. So long cinemas looks like streaming is taking over the big screen. Goodbye, popcorn buckets and hello subscription services. It's time to say goodbye to the movie theaters. Uh, calling all cinephiles. The decade will be the last to get you to enjoy movies in theaters. Who needs a theater seat when you can watch movies on your couch? Making plans for cinema tonight? Better hurry up and make them now while you still can. End of an era. Don't miss out on the last chance to catch a flick at your local theater. It's not going to last much longer. Big screen fans gather around. It's like we're in the cinematic revolution over the next decade. So long, movie theaters. And I'm just going to keep these here. These are kind of funny. Like, no more wannabe superheroes running down the aisle shouting, Hulk smash, how is that fair? Uh, and so on and so forth. Uh, I guess that's what you get for charging $15 for popcorn and soda. So some of these are pretty witty and funny, and I can see why they would go on Twitter. Just I'll leave that there in case you want to go through those. But that was just a very quick showing when it comes to Jasper.ai for social media. Don't forget that you can actually write like long posts, but you can do that using like paragraph generators. There's so much more you can do outside of just the the, um, social media aspect right here. You can pretty much use all of these. Like you can do commands, you can do paragraphs. You could write almost a full article and put it on there if you wanted to, if that's what you're looking to do. But just kind of letting you know that what comes along with Jasper is going to be much more outside than just this social media bubble here. Either way, I hope you got some value out of this video. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. I'll also have my link in the description where if you click that, you can get a free trial and some good bonus words for creating a lot of social media content. That about does it. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.